Hi everyone, it's Shell here from Designs by Shell. Thanks for joining me today. Uh, you might remember a couple uh, videos back, I made some uh, backgrounds using these clear flourish stamps. Uh, that was this package here. And uh, today I thought I would um, make a couple of cards um, using those backgrounds. So I'll show you the first one I did and then we'll make one together. So this is um, using the darker background. It's got the lighter pink um, flourish that I stamped first on there and then the darker uh, one on top. So it kind of overlays on it a little bit. And um, so that's the background I chose for this card. And the cards are um, featuring the stamp, You're One of a Kind. And what I've done is stamped it on a scallop uh, shape die that I cut out there and uh, embossed it. I used um, the Recollections embossing powder. I think this one is called sil just silver, yeah. Um, so I used that and um, I did some layering of the scallops on there. I think it three on there. And then I uh, just added some little uh, embellishments on the front there. So it turned out really nice. On the inside, I just stamped one of the little flourish designs in the corner. So uh, that's the card um, we're gonna go ahead and make today. These, this is a really nice stamp, the You're One of a Kind. And now where did I get that from? Um, this package here, um, it's called Anyone Can Stamp and it's got all kinds of friendship uh, messages in there. So that was the You're One of a Kind stamp that I used from there. So, um, and I also, these are the uh, scallop dies that I used to uh, cut the shapes out for this. And um, they come in a variety of sizes. And uh, so we're gonna go ahead and put one of those together. Okay, so this is the background I've chosen to use today. It's kind of the silvery gray uh, color and um, with the flourishes on there. So we're gonna, I've already cut that out with uh, my rectangle uh, die. Now we're gonna put that on here. It's a good way to use those uh, backgrounds that we stamped the other day. They're really pretty. So that will be the background. And then I've got some of the, the scallops cut out already. So I thought I would go with this kind of darker, uh, so it's kind of a uniform blue um, solid color that I, I uh, cut out there. So we're gonna put that on. Next here, I'm gonna just use my crafter's adhesive tape for that. I'm gonna just kinda center it on here. There we go, like so. And then now uh, this one I have um, already um, stamped and embossed the You're One of a Kind on here, but I will do a uh, one of these embossing to show you um, when we finish this card. Okay, so we're gonna put this on. Like so. And then I've got the, a border frame one um, that we're gonna put on top here like we did on, I did on the first one there. So that's gonna go just on top like this. So I think for this, I'll use some of my glue to put on the back here. Get a little bit on. Just want enough to stick it, but not so that it oozes out everywhere. And we'll just get this lined up on here. That looks nice. Kind of makes the sentiment pop out there. And now for this one that I did, I had these little flat kind of puffy stickers. Um, uh, for this one, I think we're going to use, maybe go with these little silver shapes, some just kind of some offset triangles on here. So we'll see if that will look, look all right on here. Let me take this bigger one. Hmm. So I'm going to stick it down here. I'm just kind of going to randomly stick them on there. Maybe the little one kind of over here towards the top. Hopefully they're not too big <laughs> for this, but we'll see. Maybe one there. So I think it's good to do odd numbers when you're adding embellishments. So 
Um, we'll just go with three on there. So I think that looks pretty good. And then the inside has got the uh, stamp flourish in the same color as the front there. So that's pretty quick and easy to put together. So um, I hope you get some inspiration from that. And uh, I'll go ahead and do a stamp of um, the You're One of a Kind. I'll show you the stamp that I have for that. And then we'll emboss it. So this is a, the stamp from there, You're One of a Kind. I've just got it on my acrylic block. I'm gonna use my black uh, ink pad here. This ink pad is quite, uh, quite juicy, I guess is the word I've heard someone use. <laughs> so we'll see if we can get it on here without mucking it up too much. You can see that. Actually, I'm, okay, yeah, I'll do it. <laughs> okay, now we're going to get the embossing powder. Put that on top here. Okay, so I've got that stamped on there and got my emboss embosser set up here. So we're just gonna go ahead and do the embossing. This takes a couple minutes. You can see it's starting to get shiny and sparkly there. you can see that on there but it's shiny and sparkly and looks nice and here this is one that I've just stamped black and I've left this one without the embossing so you can see the difference there so that was kind of fun to do today so um, I hope you enjoyed that and we'll see you in the next video bye for now